Hey guys, what's up? Steve backing up with another video. So I finally got my camera in, which is what I'm shooting with. So I'm really excited. But today we're going to do something a little different. We're going to take a look at the Google Now launcher. Now this is one of my favorite launchers. I think it's the most smoothest launcher that I've used. So as you can see, you can customize what you want to see. Like It's, um, it's like a news feed. It's almost like briefing, and you get like, for me, I get the latest tech news on on my screen, and then weather for my location. So here, here's how it looks. When you pull up the, the little circles, it's like folders. I like how it's like a simplistic, near to, to stock Android, I really like it. It just looks really smooth. And you can add like unlimited pages, but I only have three. Alright guys, so let me show you how to do it. So first of all, let's go ahead and uninstall it. So let's go to... Let's go to Play Store. Oh, and by the way, I do have the Google keyboard. I really like it. So let's go ahead and uninstall it so I can show you how to do it. <clears throat> it's actually really simple. There's really nothing to do. So all you do is you look up Google Now Launcher on the Google Play Store. You hit install. So we'll wait a few seconds for it to install. So yeah guys, I just thought it would be a cool different video to do. Because I love this launcher and I'm sure a lot of people would like to give their phone a different look other than TouchWiz. So there you go. It's downloaded now. All you have to do, go to open and it takes you to your home screen. There you go. That's all you have to do. Now you have a different look other than the regular TouchWiz. And this is on my Note 4. So yeah, guys, thanks for watching. I'm going to have some more product reviews coming up really soon. And here in a day or two, I'll have some more cases for the Note 4. So look forward to that. And I'll probably be doing maybe a review on my camera that I got. Because I think it's like a really great starting camera for someone that's starting out on their YouTube. I think it's very affordable. And it'd help out a lot of people. So let me know if you guys want that a review for my camera. It's a Samsung WB350F. So it's really awesome. And I can sync it with my phone and send pictures and videos back to it. So it's awesome. So let me know, guys. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe if you like my videos. I'll catch you guys later. Peace.